Hmm. I know some of us do eat egg, but we don't know the spiritual benefits of egg. Hmm. Some of us do eat egg. We use it to cook indomie. We use it in our skincare routine. But do you know that egg have a spiritual benefit? Do you know? Do you know that you can use egg to untie yourself from evil bondage? Do you know? Do you know that you can use your uh, egg to release yourself from any negative bondage? Hmm? Come closer. Come closer. Today's video. We are going to be discussing on how you can use egg to liberate yourself from every negative bondage, to liberate yourself, to untie yourself anywhere that they have tied your destiny down. Use this egg like this and come and thank me later. Please, if you are coming across this channel for the first time, you are highly welcome. In this channel, we share spiritual tips that will help us in our spiritual life. So if you love spiritual things, carry your popcorn, come, 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 come closer because this video is for you. What are you going to be doing? Just get your egg. Okay? When you get egg, let's say for instance, you are a lady and you have reached the age for you to marry and nothing is showing up. What you are going to do is just get egg. Hmm? Uncooked one, uncooked one. When you get your egg, maybe enter inside your bedroom. Okay? Enter inside your bedroom. Say your intention. As I break this egg, I break every yoke. That is making me to still remain in my father's house at this age. I break every yoke that is tying me down. I break every yoke that is holding my marriage. You know, say your prayer. Say it with all your full chest. After saying your prayer, just use the egg around your head into it three times. Just use it one, use it two, use it three, three times. After using it to round your your head make sure you say your prayer make sure you say your intention because this is not a joke this is not a joke you cannot use egg on any remedy and you say that you did not get an answer it has never happened egg is very very powerful spiritual imagine when you break break an egg do you know it's a very big something that you break do you know that it's not like they just they don't joke with egg anyhow any place that you they are going to do any spiritual work for you and they ask you to break egg mind you that that work is a very strong work okay after saying your prayer rounding your head into three three times then you break it say as i break this i break every yoke i break every bondage i break everything that is tying my marriage tying my destiny down today it have come to an end you break it as after breaking it Keep thanking God for answering your prayer. Keep thanking God for, you know, blessing you. Just have the faith and have the belief that you have broken everything that is holding your marriage. And believe you me, you are going to see a positive answer. When you are finished breaking it, just use water. You know, pour water on it and use it and sweep it away. Okay? If you are staying in a place that, you know, maybe you don't have space where you can break the egg, you break it inside your bedroom room, just wash it away and sweep out uh, the that's a crack on it okay then if you're in a place that you have compound you can come outside and do that okay you can come outside to your house and do that and that would be the end end of all those negative stuff all those promise and fail all those maybe someone will promise you marriage today tomorrow you'll be hearing another thing altogether just give this a try and come and thank me later okay so if you find this video interesting don't forget to share and if you have not subscribed do well to subscribe to my channel okay and remember to click on that uh, notification bell so that each time i upload a new video you'll be among the first people that will get notified i'm going to be bringing a bonga spiritual remedy because god have blessed us with so many things around us that have so many spiritual power but we neglect them we think that they are diabolic my dear they are not because even if you go to church some of pastors and reverends they make use of that because of what they know that it's very very powerful they know that god created this and they have given us power for us to use it so when you use it in a positive way it is going to work for you you did not kill anybody so why do you believe that it's diabolic so let's help ourselves with the little things that is around us okay see you in my next video